Hey y'all, I'm back at it with a little, a little feast. I made too many tater tots, dang nabbit. I had a craving. I think I'm having grandma cra pregnancy cravings. <laughs> I mean, I like scrapple, y'all. I haven't had scrapple in a long time. So I got me a scrapple egg and cheese sandwich, some cheddar cheese on there. I usually toast my bread, but I didn't feel like it. I wanted to try it like this. And the tater tots. Mmm. Yeah. yeah, they're good. Um. How y'all been? What y'all been up to? I've just been cleaning up after that baby shower. Just pretty good now. This is all raw, finally. Take care of, oh, I got me a Diet Pepsi. Oh. Yeah, we got two 12 packs of soda for getting to get regular soda. <laughs> so, I'm left with a lot of soda. Ah, so yeah, breakfast. Breakfast of champions over here. I'm not gonna eat all this, but. Oh, my head is just scrambled. This is banana pudding that I forgot to get bananas and the wafers after I made the pudding, so that's all right. I'll pick up some wafers tonight and then do make it later. It's all good. All right, that's, oh boy. <laughs> She's a monster. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's so piping hot. Mmm. Mm. Oh, look at that. Some scrap on cheese got on my tater tot. Mmm. Mmm. Not as crispy as I like the. I like my scrap of really crispy, but. I had a chip. Cut me on my gum back here, so I'm trying not to eat too much. Tater tots aren't as crispy as I like them either. And of course, the ranch. Gotta have the ranch. You guys ever tried that um, um, Hen Valley Ranch? The packets that you make your own like dip with. That's pretty good stuff. I keep forgetting to get sour cream. I still got a package of that up there. Mmm. That better. <laughs> I was going to use a little barbecue, but I'm kind of barbecued out from the barbecue wings, the barbecue meatballs. <sighs> I'm probably taking the rest of the meatballs for lunch tonight at work. Mmm. I love tater tots. Mmm. I'm Irish. I like potatoes. <laughs> My favorite vegetable, I think. <laughs> That's so versatile. Mm. So what's new with y'all? Nothing much here. Oh boy. Give me some of that. I put a lot of cheese on this too. But this will be the only thing I eat until 2 o'clock in the morning, so. <laughs> mm. And it's only, oh shit. I'm looking for my phone that I'm using to record for crying out loud. <laughs> mm-hmm. Better with toast, though. Better on toast, but like I said, I had a chip get me right there. Actually, cut my gum. Um, up here it kind of back up. So I'm eating softish things, like because I like my scrapple basically burnt. We all like scrapple. <laughs> I'm all about the scrapple. Man. I only eat it like once a year. 
Got me a big old package of it, and I just, I've had it. Oh, this is my second sandwich in the last week, so if my son don't start eating it, it's gonna go bad. Maybe I'll freeze half of it, there's an idea. Ooh, so basically not a lot's going on. Um, I'm working hard. You know, get, trying to get things ready for the babies coming. I have to be honest. It took me a while to get excited about. That. Mmm, you see that? Mm. I mean, I wasn't excited about like granny, grandma. Oh my gosh, I'm a grandma. <laughs> now I'm waiting. Not too patiently either. I want the baby now. Right now. <laughs> and September's just around the corner, so. I'll be good. Um, what I say? Not a lot. Really. The air quality sucks. With that smoke coming from Canada. You hear that? That's what that is. My son woke up sick. But he went fishing last night and I think the air quality may have gotten to him and made him irritated. But mine's from taking my break and sitting in the car with the window down. That's my solitude. I gotta get away and just You know what I mean? But nothing spectacular happened around here this week. Fourth of July is next week. Not doing anything. I gotta work. <laughs> Might make some burgers or something. I gotta work. I was gonna make shrimp alfredo today, but I'm just tired during the week, so I may make that Sunday or Monday. Probably. <laughs> Today with these, I don't know if it's allergies or if it's the air quality. I don't know. I said, I did it again. It was like 5 30, I think. I got up at 3 40. I've been sleeping pretty good this week. I've been getting at least six hours every day. Oh, this is a record. This is, it, it was four hours for a while. Like, I need to rest. I kind of got to force myself. Like, if I get up, go to the bathroom, or get a drink. Excuse me. You know, it's daytime. I can see it's daytime. My brain automatically. Because it's daytime, get up, dummy. So I kind of got to force myself to lay back down. Because I can feel that I'm tired and I need more sleep, but sometimes my brain just won't. It's been doing it good this week. Which is good. 
This is the sixth day week for me this week because I switched one of my days off, not thinking. But I didn't have a choice because if I would have worked Saturday, Sunday by the baby shower, I would have been completely exhausted. I was anyway, but it was just from every excitement and everything going on. Oh, good Lord. Mmm, that is so good. Sharp cheddar cheese. Mmm. I love tea. <laughs> What's your guys' favorite cheese? Mine's gotta be. Hmm. Um. Cheddar. It'd probably be easier to tell you what cheese I don't like. That Lindenburg cheese. It smells like there's gym socks that haven't been washed in 22,000 years. <laughs> so I went to an Amish market one time and they had all samples of all cheeses that they had in their cases. All of them. You could just go and help yourself. So I did. And I got to that one. I couldn't even get past the smell of it in order to put it in my mouth. Maybe once, you know, you're chewing on it, it tastes better. Oh, I don't like pimento cheese. I don't like it. Mm -mm. These aren't real cheese. I don't know. It's just got a weird texture. Good lord, I was starving before. I'll probably eat all of it before I go to work, but I've been watching a lot of Eric the Electric. I don't know how that man cut loads like that. That is just whew. A couple weeks I am gonna try the twelve taco challenge. I am gonna do that one. I wish there was a uh White Castle in Maryland because I'd like to do that 30 pack challenge. <laughs> I think I could do that. <laughs> I don't think so, but this is a hefty, hefty, hefty. Look at that. You see that? Oh my god. Would have definitely been better with one toes. Mmm, 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 mmm. That is so good. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so fly. Mm. I gotta find my flesh. Wow. <clears throat> Trying to think of things interesting to tell y'all. Um, I don't know. My stomach's growling while I'm eating. I don't know what that means. And my Tommy thanking me for the good food? Maybe. <laughs> Mm, this is just yummy. I'm gonna think about this all day. Well, not all day, but last night I was like, I need to make a muffin. What am I going to eat? Oh, scrapple, egg, cheese, tater tots. <laughs> I'm on this fascinating tater tot kick. You know, I'm that person that will eat french fries cold, tater tots cold. I will eat potatoes cold. 
it's just I love them. Mm. Okay. Excuse me. Rise and sun. I was trying to think what did my shirt say. I'm gonna take one more bite of that. I'm getting full. Take one more good bite. Mmm. Oh boy. That's something. That's so good. Mmm. So. Oh, the other day the dog got in the trash. We thought we was going to have to take him to the vet hospital. He's all right. I'll back baby gate and put it up there. So we are, you can't leave him alone to even check the mail. So, I'm going to put a baby gate in the kitchen. I mean, we got to get baby gates eventually anyway. Might as well get them now. That'd be the only one we need for this apartment. Actually. So, so two purposes. Keep the baby out of the kitchen, keep the dog out of the kitchen. Oh, get on my I love them. That's all we got. I don't know if you guys could hear that. Okay. I'm gonna be seen today, do you? I'm sitting here, minding my business, eating my food. You know how you hit the blinds? It makes that sound. I don't have the air on because I didn't want it making my food cold. But it sounded like somebody smacked the blinds and then like three or four of them just moved. Yeah. Because somebody had hit the blinds. I don't know if you guys heard that or not. Okay, dokie. Mmm, I'm gonna put that to the side for a while. Ooh, Co Whip is on top. I like Co Whip. Mm. It's just their instant banana pudding without the bananas and without the wafers. I'm gonna get the wafers tomorrow, though. Oh boy. Yeah, I did that right. First, I put it in a, in a too small of a container for the six cups of milk required. <laughs> so, everything's gonna come out right, but it, excuse me, goodness. It's good, let's see. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh my. Yep. Look at there. Look at there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. What's your favorite pudding? You guys like pudding? Like I said, I'm craving strange things all of a sudden. I mean, people eat pudding. I don't. And it's not sugar-free. I've tried that sugar-free stuff. I don't like it. I don't eat that much sweets, so worry about it. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, this is the Jello variety, Jello pudding brand. I was wondering if it was the Walmart brand. No, they didn't have a banana. There is a difference. Now I'm going to do a taste comparison. I'm going to get a chocolate jello pudding and a chocolate great value pudding. Let's see. Because I think the great value doesn't get as thick. Like that's good pudding right there. Unless it's just the sugar-free that I've made of great value and it 
it's kind of a little not as thick. Oh, runny. Mmm. <laughs> um, that's good. I'm just not trying to gut love myself here because that's a big sandwich. There's a lot of taters. But it will sit right next to me while I sit here and watch Hungry Fat Chick. And relax before I go to work while I'm waiting on this video to upload. I changed shampoos. Well, I didn't change brands. I changed type. Because I was doing the Gardier Sleek and Shine. But I noticed it wasn't sleeking and it wasn't shining. And it was starting to feel a little... Mm. Even though I used the leave-in conditioner, regular conditioner, and shampoo, I think... There was such a buildup, so I switched to Garnier Grow Strong. Oh, that's the even. I mean, it's it's from the same brand, the same type of line, but it seems like a better quality shampoo. Like it's thicker. You don't need as much, and the leave-in conditioner. Um. It's, it's got like 10 different things on it. It, 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 conditioner, it helps grow your hair strong, a detangler, which when I get out, I remember to brush my hair though, today, before, I usually brush it after I take a shower, but making a video, I didn't want to look, oh god, I gotta shave my pit, I didn't want to look too, you know, enough, but you just need a little bit. Like one square is plenty. So there's that. Now my hair is so soft again. Oh, it's so soft. Plus, I just colored it this past weekend, and that always makes it soft. Like that conditioner. As far as it strips it everything out and then puts it right back in, so. You gotta have good quality hair care products when you're coloring your hair. I don't color as often as I should. It's more or less the reason why it's two shades. But I kind of like it like that, though. A little lighter at the bottoms and darker at the top. Just as lightly, I mean. Okay, right, y'all. I'm gonna get off of here. Because I'm full. And I'm racking my brain trying to think of what to say. So, man's in Florida doing a job, moving job. He's been going since Monday. So, we're working on things. Just remember, people, relationships aren't perfect, and relationships are far from easy. So, gotta work at things. If you think it's worth it, I mean, unless you're in a dangerous situation, then get the hell out of it. No wonder I'm weird. It's got the cushion all wrong. But, um, what the hell was I saying? I got stuck. My ADD is kicking in bad today. I swear I have ADD. Never been diagnosed. I just. My mind shifts gears like, whew. drives my best friend, Paige, she drives her crazy because she's like, you didn't finish your other thought. What was I saying? <laughs> oh, about relationships. Gotta work hard at them sometimes. It's like, what is where is that from? Oh, from the light coming in. See how I have to debunk everything? <laughs> this is ridiculous. 
Uh, y'all leave a comment if you heard what sounded like somebody hitting the blinds a little bit ago, like 10 minutes into the, or 15 minutes, in, 17 minutes into the video, something to that effect. All right. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't move. This love seat's got to, this couch has got to go. Man. All right. Y'all love you. My finger is just. This is my bad finger that I have trouble with the tendon or the ligament or whatever. It gets really itchy sometimes. All right. Hit the like. Subscribe. Leave me a comment. Tell your friends, your neighbors, your strangers. All right. Love y'all. See you later.